We are here everyone at the Lafayette Hotel. Don't mind the strange tribal band in the background. That's just Tony's alarm on his tablet. But after <laughs> after a crazy week at school and APs That's and tests, we are going to be hanging out in Maine, the final state that I have not been to on the East Coast. Besides Rhode sure. Island, but Rhode Island, I don't I don't consider a state. It's basically just a small territory. Oh my God, okay, finally the tribal music has stopped. Yes. But um, anyway, we are here. Right next to the water, I can smell the dying fish, the mermaids, and Disgusting. the pirates, probably. <laughs> Tony is <laughs> chiming in over here yes. with his comments. Don't yes. say that. That's disgusting. That's right, Tony. <laughs> we are right here next to the ocean. This is a uh, Oceanside Hotel. We might have a fantastic view of the water. Apparently, you can hear the waves crashing against the beach at night while you sleep, which sounds like a bunch of romanticized crap to me but yeah, you know Conrad? what maybe it's true i don't Conrad? know we're gonna have to see ah yes drift wind resort open year round because here we are going to be drifting in the wind right mom mm -hmm. it's gonna be a great time there's an indoor pool here it's a little too cold um for uh for swimming in the ocean because this is of course the Conrad. cold atlantic and this is maine so it is going to be a little bit chilly but we do have an indoor swimming pool here that we are going to be uh, going into and tony is going to have a little snorkel which used to be mine but now it's his how do you feel about that tony great i'll swim underwater but please don't feed me dead fish no promises to be kept but i'll try not to okay okay sounds like a deal Great. Mom is, of course, very excited. She is an ocean connoisseur. She is a maritime professional. She is a sailor of the seas. Right, Mom? Yeah. Yes. It's your bedtime. It's a little late. Whoa, bazinga, everyone. Look at that. <laughs> Holy. Dude, there is a ship out there. You can see the light of the ship. <laughs> Just out in the middle of the Atlantic. Wait, look, look. Yeah. Oh my god. Everyone, we are in our room and we have direct, direct access to the ocean. Oh my god. What? Whoa, there's literally stairs going down here. Oh my god. During high tide, these stairs are going to be like... Flooded. Oh, this is incredible. All right, we need to go get the bag. Definitely Oof. It is chilly out here. <laughs> oh, we're on the air? <laughs> yeah, we are. This it is cold over here. Here, I'm gonna touch the water. Ooh. <laughs> it's chilly, yeah. It is the next day. We are here at the Lafayette Hotel, of course. We weren't transported overnight, so we're still in the same area, but look how different it looks in the daytime. We have a gorgeous view of the Atlantic Ocean. It is pretty much completely open. There's no obstruction of land besides like a bazillion miles away where there's like the France or uh, the, or the France, yes, France or something like that. Ooh. <laughs> oh yeah. Later we're going to be c catching some authentic main 
seafood. We're gonna, I'm gonna jump in with my bare hands into the ocean and hopefully pull out a lobster. So we're, we're gonna see what we can do with that. Maybe I'll pull out my hands and I'll just have like a, a ball full of shrimp or something just like in my claws and I can just raw eat all the shrimp just at once. Maine Diner, this is the primary diner to visit here in Maine. Get it, it is Maine. It's kind of main diner. It's the main diner to I visit. My own gift. Guys, we got Guy Fieri from Diners, Drive-Ins, and Dives, and apparently he he was born. Oh well, okay. Gee, sorry, no, no, no. I meant he he visited this place. He wasn't born in the restaurant. Keep oh. cooking. Keep cooking. Yeah, <laughs> that's so cool. And we get some good breakfast here. Which are we gonna get? Yeah, but Tony's got some blueberry pancakes. What are you getting? So, what? What are you getting? Oh, I don't know yet. I'm, I'm not sure. And people are gonna start thinking I'm the next guy Fieri over here. Come to, <laughs> coming to harass their establishment. Maybe I am. Who knows? I'm gonna start feasting on everything, recording. People are gonna come in with a camera crew. I'm gonna be like, oh, man, this is some good stuff. You see. Why they're famous for the blueberry pancakes because they're actually good. Mm. Alright guys, we're about to try out a sea salt taffy. Um they kinda taste like just they kinda okay, so picture this scenario. You're in bed bath and beyond. And you're in the candle section, right? And you go up to the aisle and you rip a candle out of the package and you take okay. a massive bite out of it, right? It's one of like those kind of kind of like tastes, sea salt flavored yeah. fruity candles. You bite into it and you can just taste the wax melting in your mouth as the wick like rubs up against your teeth. Okay, I'm about to spit it out now. Right now we are going to Lobster Point Lighthouse, which I, I, I don't know if this is gonna be like the Cape Cod thing here. Let's let's flash a little clip from that video. <laughs> That's the lighthouse. <laughs> Someone just slapped a lantern on top of this this old man's the house or something. The will be a flashlight on top of the chimney. <laughs> yeah, um, th there was a, a flashlight on top of a house. I'm hoping that this isn't that type of lighthouse, but an actual lighthouse because that's been on my bucket list for a while to see a real one. Light and in Cape Cod, we didn't quite up. get that. We didn't he quite get that sick. luck. Oh, this is absolutely gorgeous, everyone. Look at that. You can see the whole beach on that end. Look at that. Oh, yes, guys. This is ridiculous. I think I'm about as tall as this lighthouse. Do you send a family, please? It's Alright everyone, that's Poseidon's bathtub over there. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna get attacked. <laughs> oh my god, I almost slipped. Jesus, I gotta be careful here. Oh my god, am I gonna get attacked?
you can see like the contour of the waves. This is nice. It's like a organism. It's all moving. Right. So honestly, when my mom said lighthouse, I expected like you guys know the design of the Cape Cod bag of chips. You know the lighthouse that's on that. That's what I expected, like a big, nice. tall, grand lighthouse on a cliff. That's not really what that was. But we are going to another one, which we check the photos, and it looks pretty dang cool. <laughs> The Nubble Light. Guys, we have we have some geese residents at the lighthouse. I'm assuming they are the caretakers of the residents. <laughs> New main souvenir, everyone. My God, we spend one day in here and we're immediately hooking ourselves up with these fantastic souvenirs. Look at this. All right, everyone, it is loud out here. It is windy. My God, this is awesome. Pool formed over here, which is really cool. It's like rippling with the, with the wind. <laughs> No way! Yeah. Dude, it's a crab! Yeah. Oh no! Oh. It's flipping. I just don't want it pinching me because they have pinchers, so. Watch Whoa. out! Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Wow! <laughs> He's flipped over, we gotta rescue him. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe he got flipped over right now. Dude, I can't. Oh, there he is! Look at him go! <laughs> oh, that's so incredibly cool! Got a nice view outside. This is good man. stuff. We're here in Billy's Chowder House, and we're gonna be eating some good seafood here. At least I'm hoping so. so. Mm, well done. How's the shrimp scampi, Dad? Good stuff. Nice. Okay. Uh, the shrimp's campy, it's fantastic, we've got some great fries here. Fish and chips, that's fish. Man, this is good stuff. Mm. Alright everyone, we're here at the indoor swimming pool and man does it look nice. And Tony wants to go snorkel underwater, right Tony? <laughs> Just say you forgot to put the snorkel in. Jeez, Tony. Holy... 
Dude, oh my god. Holy crap. Wow. Oh shoot. Oh shoot, that's coming in. Whoa. Storms of ruin. Oh my god. Dude, oh, these are some big swells. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Alright guys, we're leaving the Lafayette Hotel. Oh man, this is this is our last view. Oh, and a seagull's coming in. Look at that. There we go guys, Lafayette's Hotel. We're leaving the gorgeous view and we're going home. We still got some activities to do, but this is the last time we see the hotel. This is our checkout. Feasting on these Belgian waffles. Mmm, Tony's enjoying it.